For the best prices and service on Pokemon TCG singles and products, check out ccgcastle.com and use promo code EVOLUTIONARIES-5 for 5% off your next order. What's up, Pokemon fans? I'm Professor K. And I'm Ed. And today we've got two Darkrai Level X tins. These are some old things right here, I'll tell you that right now. When are these actually made from? All the way back in 2008, which means these tins are essentially 10 years old because we're right at 2018. I mean, let's just be honest here. So these tins are old. As a matter of fact, there's still dust on them. I can still feel the dust coming off of these things. So they've been sitting around for a little while. I did manage to find them on eBay for a very, very good price considering uh, the fact that as soon as I bought them, they basically doubled the price on them. I don't know if that really, they, th they didn't realize that they uh, listed them lower than what they should have, but I'm gonna say that's a pretty good sign that uh, we got a really good deal. So, I've actually bought three of them. I'm keeping one sealed for my sealed collection and N and I are gonna open both of these up here today and see who gets the better pulls, I guess. Yeah, because we're always gonna battle each other. That's right, we are always in constant competition. So this is an old tin. You guys may or may not have seen the back of these before, but if you want to read them, you can pause it. I'm not gonna put you through it. But there you go. Good. <laughs> in here we do have four packs of Diamond and Pearl series booster packs. So um, there's going to be just, uh, what is it? Let's see, Diamond and Pearl, Mysterious Treasure, Secret Wonders. Um, I forget the other ones. Wasn't really around too much for those, but uh, well, let's get started. And I'm going to let you start first. Oh, thank you. I'll take the dented Tim. <laughs> oh, well, it's open up easily. Well, I mean, the plastic on it's 10 years old, so. True. All right. Oh, man, this card is destroyed. Wow. Holy cow. I'm not much of a collector, but this makes me cringe. That is bad. I wonder how that even happens inside of a tin. Age, maybe? The only thing I can think of? I don't even think so, unless they crushed it somehow. But then the tin would be dented like the one in my hand is. Uh, that's insane. Alright, so this is Dark Gray Level X. This basically works the same way as um, Breaks did, except your opponent, your Pokemon had to be active to evolve into this. So, it has 100 HP, it can use all the attacks in the previous evolution, again just like Breaks. It's got the Pokebody Dark Shadow. Each basic dark energy attached to your Pokemon now has the effect of if the Pokemon darkness energy is attached to attacks, this attack does 10 more damage. So basically, it gives all dark energy attached to all of your dark Pokemon the same effect as the old dark, as the old special dark energy, which was almost like strong energy for dark Pokemon. So really, really good there. Also, you can use more more than one dark shadow Pokebody each turn. So, Endless Darkness, two dark and a colorless does 40 damage. And if any Pokemon is not asleep, you flip two coins instead of one. If either of them are tails, the Pokemon is still asleep. If both of them are tails, the defending Pokemon is knocked out. Yuck. Brutal. Even by today's standards, that would be brutal. Yeah, no kidding. Alright. How do I pull this out? Like, there's nowhere secure to grab it. <laughs> No, I'm serious. That's well, that was before they made the uh, the changes to the tin. Yeah, this plastic almost feels like smolt melted. All right, so we have four packs here: one diamond pearl, secret encounters. I mean, no, 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 great encounters. Two diamond pearl, secret wonders, and one diamond pearl, mysterious treasures. I'll go with mysterious treasures because that's Garchomp on it, and Garchomp is cool. I'll keep one of these tins. Oh wow, that one is actually is dented. Not as bad as the other one, though. Yeah, the other one's worse. All right, and this is far, and this is way before the days of PTCGO, so there are no code cards here. All right, so first off, we get an armor fossil. We have Pikachu, Doduo, Weasel with Chesto Berry. Now, I actually, even though I didn't play in Diamond Pearl earlier, I actually like the idea of Pokemon's having berries on them. Something you can use every turn. This one says if Weasel's asleep, remove a special condition from it at the end of the turn. So, pretty cool, pretty cool. Got Lavatar, Craniodos, Quick Ball, Hoppini, Reverse Hollow is a Chansey, and a Mr. Mime non-Hollow Rare. All right, next up, let's go into a Secret Wonders. 
why do packs like to humiliate me like this? Because it's easy. <laughs> Shut up. All right, so we have Growlithe. Shop it. Shelder. red tat tat Venonet. Milk Tank. Unknown X. Cloister. Reverse Hollow Team Galactic Mars. Wait a minute. Look yeah. at... No, no, look! It's literally the same artwork! It is? Yep, yeah, same pose! Wait a second. And I gotta go back and look through our stacks. Because we literally just opened up... Okay, the rare is a jinx, but okay, yeah, we need to... We just filmed it not that long ago. The Team Galactic Mars should be in here somewhere. You don't have it? Nope. Okay. I'll keep looking. You keep going. All right. Put that one to the side. So we need to go back to that. That is rather interesting. It is kind of fitting that we're opening up these packs, considering that's the era that's coming. Yep. This supposed next remake. All right, so we got Slugma, got Mudkeep, Caterpie, with the Poke Power, Pupitate. Okay. Oh, I gotta read this. Once per turn, I mean, once during your turn, if your Caterpie is your active Pokemon, you may flip a coin. If heads, you search your deck for a card that evolves from Caterpie and put it onto Caterpie. Shuffle your deck afterwards. It was in your stack, by the way. You just missed it, and you're right. It's the same pose. Pupitate. All right, so we have Glammeow, Makahita. I'll compare them in a second. Gramble, Mushtomp, Leftovers. Ooh, we got a Reverse Hollow Rare, Porygon Z, and a Butterfree. Not Hollow Rare. Like, dead on the same. Yeah. Just zoomed in a little bit. Yeah, one of them is just partial, and the other one's more full body, but same pose. They're doing the same things with their hands, same smirk, like everything. Wow, talk about recycling. <laughs> or it's paying homage. You can look at it either way. All right, my final pet before I hand it to Professor K. I would like to get at least a hollow here. All right, so we have... <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, that's fun. We're going to see a lot of those. Um, Nidoran boy. Diggly. Bulbasaur. Corsola. Unknown Z. Another Team Galactic Mars. Schmeargle. Reverse Hollow Rare Blastoise. Okay, I got another Reverse Hollow Rare and a Magmortar. <laughs> I got no hollows or nothing. You got zero. I just got two points, which is two Reverse Rares. Okay, yeah, you're gonna have like no problem beating me. All right, so all we gotta do is get a hollow to tie. That I like. Those are good, good odds for me. Wow, this is just like paper coming off of here. Wow. All right. Well, the good news is, is that my card is pretty jacked up. Darn it. <laughs> I was hoping it wasn't. Oh my God. Oh man. The quality control though. Neither one of these dark eyes are in any shape whatsoever to be uh, considered uh, worth keeping or grading or trading even. Nobody's even gonna want that. Oh man. Crazy, stupid. Yeah, I mean, it's, it all has to do with the way they designed this, I think, because it's so easy to uh, move them around when they're not actually stuck in there, which is funny because our biggest complaint is that they're stuck too well now. So I guess there really was no middle ground. I am also having trouble getting this plastic off of here. Come on, <laughs> this is ridiculous. Get out of there, plastic. My gosh, there we go, finally. Yeah, this is a really weird design. I'm not a fan of that at all. There's the rest of the card, by the way. It got stuck to the plastic. Wow. Well, you know, maybe we got the worst tins that they had because of how cheap they were. Uh, that could be it too. <laughs> Lamp, but that would be so gross. That would be. All right, I so be this Great Encounters pack looks really messed up. It's like. Like it's been melted. That's what the front pack of mine looked like too. Hmm. Rather interesting, but the cards seem to be okay, so that's the important thing. All right, let's get started with our first first pack here. We've got an Illumise, Makihita, 
Jigglypuff, Wingull, Caterpie, Relicanth, Metapod, Rare Candy, Reverse Hollow Chicken Nugget, Torchic, and an unknown, not all rare. All right, let's try Mysterious Treasures next. Leave really the two secret wonders for last. Three and two. All right, so we got Teddy Ursa, very cute looking Teddy Ursa, Snover, Electrike, Spoil, Magby, Cranidos, Dugong, Dodrio, Reverse Hollow Abra, and a Honchcrow Hollow. What? Yay, I got a Hollow. <laughs> that is so dumb. Even though it's the evolution of Jerkrow. Ew. <laughs> Two packs left to go. Three. Oh, wow. These are actually stuck together. Three and two. All right. Shroomish, Squirtle, Centret, Charmander, Thampy, Muck, Quagsire, Plus Power, Reverse Hollow, Roseanne's Research, and a Plusle. Hmm. Don't forget Reverse Rare. Well, we only got one more shot to go, and there's a Bagon in this pack. Poor Bagon. All right, final pack. We've got Bagon, Nidoran, Diglett, Bulbasaur, Corsola, Bebe Search, Roselia, Curlia, Reverse Hollow Trap Inch, and a Nidoking non hollow rare, which means we actually tied. Well, that's a shame. <laughs> oh, well. Two reverse rares and a hollow. There's really not much you can expect out of these sets. I mean, you got level X's, yeah, but for the most part, it's all about the hollows, which. I happen to love the hollow designs. They do look very cool. Matter of fact, now that I get this out of the sleeve, you can see the design a little bit better. It's a little harder to tell on dark Pokemon like Honchkrow, but the design is really nice. All right, guys, that's going to do it for our old school opening of these Darkrai Level X tins. Hopefully you guys did enjoy the video. If you did, be sure to hit that like button, comment down below, subscribe for more TCG content, and we will see you guys next time. Thanks for watching. See you later. Take care.